morning everyone and welcome to day three in Chicago. It's already early in the afternoon. I tried to get breakfast at Wildberry, but it was a two hour wait, so I skipped that. Just finished having my breakfast slash lunch at Natives Cafe, something like that. I think it's like organic, vegan, something, but it was pretty good. I'm on my way to the Harold Washington Library. As soon as I hit the corner, I see this massive building. You've got to see this. Holy shit. This thing is fucking huge. Holy crap. Oh my god. I don't even know where to stay. Oh my god. I can't say enough about it. It is immaculate. It's huge. It, the entire block is a library. It's nine floors and it's just wall to wall in terms of, you know, books and whatnot. The only issue that I have with this is they don't have enough poetry and or plays, which sucks, but the library as a whole was absolutely incredible to witness. So now, I'm done with that. I'm gonna hop on this bus and try the Planetarium again. 360 Chicago observation deck. Thinking about doing tilt. I'm not sure, I think you had to pay for it. Um, we'll see what happens. What have I done? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> So I did it. I wanted the tilt. Holy crap. That was insane. That was one of the craziest things I've ever done. I was so scared, I was definitely freaking shaking. And I tilted it once, and I tilted it again, and I couldn't freaking handle it. That was insane. So after going to the observation deck at the formerly John Hancock building, which is now just called the 360 Chicago, there's a bar slash lounge on the 95th and 96th floor. I wanted to go check that out. Super nice, very classy. If you're lucky enough to get a window seat, you can see the whole city from your seats. Very romantic setting. When you're a single guy like me, whose sole purpose to go out is to meet and talk to new people, a bar slash lounge like this doesn't really work because everything is seated. So it kind of makes it difficult to just find someone to talk to. Plus, the prices were expensive as all hell. They were like $15 and up for drinks and 20 and up for food. I decided I'd come back to my room. I'm gonna change my shirt because I wore this shirt last night when I went to Timothy Old Tools. I'm gonna go back to Timothy Old Tools. But first, I need food. So once I figure out what I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna go do that. Hopefully, I can find someone to talk to tonight. So the night was a bust. She wasn't really feeling it tonight. I'm going to Wrigley Field tomorrow to catch the Cubs versus the Cards, so I'm really excited to finally go to Wrigley Field. So yeah, we'll see you all tomorrow. Night, yo.